if we look back to, say, 1950, we might have had a vague impression that if engineers were to think about medical problems, they might be able to invent things like artificial limbs. They might be able to understand the circulatory system. We had the ideas on the horizon of artificial hearts and things like that. People understood that. Today, the practice of medicine is moving much more to the genetic and molecular level. But again, there's a vague vision out there that if we take engineers who take fundamental scientific knowledge and develop technologies from them that assist people, the same thing will happen at this molecular and cellular and genetic level that happened at the more macroscopic level of things like artificial limbs and artificial hearts uh, in the last century. So there will be a role for engineering, but the nature of engineering changes with time as the science base beneath it increases.